Now you're probably wondering, what is SSI? SSI stands for Solid Shelf Influencers, and brands can take advantage of SSI to help propel their product sales growth. Um, so I believe that Glenroy said it best, and I quote, loyalty can't be purchased with advertising. In fact, millennials hate advertising, viewing it as inauthentic, end quote. So really, groundbreaking, active, and intelligent packaging helps millennials live easier, and therefore you win their hearts. And basically, once you've won their hearts, they will help spread uh, your brand uh, by writing blogs, giving reviews, posting on social media about all the products that they like. So now you're probably wondering, how can I add SSIs to my packaging? So solid shelf influencers. So now we can take the silent salesman, your package, and actually allow it to talk. HP has a technology, what's called embedded QR codes or digital watermarks, that can really make your product stand out on the shelf. Um, SSIs are the building block of active and intelligent packaging. So these next five SSIs will help your product transform into an active and intelligent package. What if your product incorporated a QR code that could be scanned? This QR code could quickly allow end users and consumers to read a blog about the experiences other people had about your product. Now we can totally spin this. That same QR code could track your package from start to finish, allowing you to find out who bought your product, where it was bought, and how fast it sold off the shelf. So later in the uh, webinar, we're going to visit some videos that talk about embedded security features and QR codes. But first, let's talk about active and intelligent packaging. So active and intelligent packaging um, can be labeled in multiple different ways, but we're going to just talk about five today. Uh, the first one is going to be augmented reality, and I'm sure you guys have heard the buzz around the industry on augmented reality and people doing very, very cool things with this. Uh, next, we're going to go into some videos talking about how you can promote a company's vision. Um, educational product training and safety, these are really neat. I don't know if you guys have ever went to the store and bought maybe say a spray bottle of chemicals and it comes with a booklet that has six or seven pages on how to use the actual product. The text is so small you can hardly read it. You almost need a magnifying glass. Um, but there's different ways that we can actually embed product training videos into our print right now. So next we're going to go to product use and promotion and contest and then finally we'll end up with security. So let's, uh, let's start the videos. Well, this is something pretty common, right? You walk into the wine store, you simply pick up a bottle of red, you pay, and you walk out, right? Well, our shopping experience is about to make a huge leap into the future with talking labels. And no, not just from me drinking too much of the wine. Tim Irwin is about to explain what the new technology that became popular with the Pokemon Go craze has to do now with our wine purchases. Tim, when I say a big leap into the future, I really mean it, right? Yeah, Tina, we're super excited to be launching the first ever talking wine label. And I think the great part is it's fun, it's interactive, and it's simple to use. So, Tina, maybe we should go through it, how it works, because it is, it is kind of the future here today. So, what you do is you go to Google Play or iTunes, you download the app, you follow the prompts, and it's very simple here. All you do is hold, the, hold your phone over the label. There's of a rogue sustains when the bars of man impede. And you can see that it starts talking to you. So what's great about this is, is 19 Crimes is, is based off authentic true stories. So in this instance here, we've got John O'Reilly, who was uh, fighting political oppression and was sentenced to mutiny. And it was either 
losing his life or going to Australia for 20 years. So it's also culture and history and the foundation of Australia. And it, that's just pretty cool. <laughs> so, and it's yeah. it's augmented reality, right? Is that is that what we're calling it? And I have my bottle here, so this little guy is going to tell me a little bit about the wine. Yeah. So, not to be confused, virtual reality is basically putting on goggles, and that's changing. Augmented reality is about changing what's in front of you. So, you know, Pokemon Go that we, we we've kind of known about for a few years. So, it's really altering the the state of. Um, and how you, how you bring it to life. So you know, each convict has a different story that they want to tell. And like I said, they're, they're real stories. It's, it's kind of taking convicts to colonists. So uh, yeah, that's what augmented reality is. And it's pretty exciting. It is pretty exciting. Now, on top of it just being cool, uh, and like you said, we're going to be able to learn a little bit. What else can we gain? I mean, obviously, I know that this wine is awesome. Yeah, you know, the shopper experience is continually changing. You know, you've got online shopping in the aisle, and I think people really want to know what they're consuming, you know, what's in the product, and this brings it to life. We know that, you know, everyone's somewhat connected to a smartphone these days, and you know, that's our source of information. So naturally, it's easy to transition there and uh, kind of learn more about it. And it's, it, as, you, as you saw, it's a very simple process, and you know, not just in store, but think about you know, going to a dinner party with family and friends at home, showing your, your partner or what have you. It's, it's so engaging, it's so fun. Like watching someone's reaction on this is, is, is really enjoyable. It's, it's, it's half the enjoyment. Oh, you will definitely be the hit at any party if you break out uh, this and show them that your bottle of wine has a talking label on it. And now this is 19 Crimes uh, wine. This is the type of wine that this app is going to work with, right? Yeah, so it's, it, we have seven different wines uh, that this kind of works on. So, you know, as I mentioned, each convict has a, a different story. So uh, the foundation for 19 Crimes is that story and the history of Australia. You know, as Australian, I'm very proud, and this, is, this was our foundation. So uh, it, it works across all our wines. As I mentioned, we've, we're slowly introducing new wines. We've just launched a hard Chardonnay that tells you the first of our female convict, Jane Fleming, and, and her story. So, uh, you know, a great way to bring these real stories to life. Well, they always say there's an app for everything. There really is an app for everything now. So we will make sure, like you said, go to our uh, you know, Google Play and, and our app store and make sure that we get that app. And then do this is going to be pretty cool to show off to everyone. Tim, this is something pretty awesome. I can't wait to try it out. Thank you so much for telling us about it. Thanks, Tina. Have fun. I will. Don't go anywhere. The Morning Blend, we'll be right back. Isn't that awesome? Uh, augmented reality is really um, how you can get people engaged with your actual product. So um, if you guys want to know more about that, we can definitely let you know. Um, this next video that I want to show you guys is all about company vision. Now Peak Enterprises is a good customer of ours. Um, he is a CPG. And basically what he wanted to do was he wanted to create a video to let people know what his actual company vision was and what he stood for. So what we did was we partnered up with him. We printed a flexible package for his tongue gel and uh, tongue brush to actually go in that had a QR code embedded in the print. So when it's sitting on the store shelf, a customer can actually come up with their phone, scan it, and it would take them directly out to this video. So let me know what you guys think about this one. Starting a business is a journey. It's one steeped in risk and uncertainty. Values learned on a ranch in Wisconsin and in the mountains of Montana served as a foundation of this journey. Small invention, designed to improve the lives of many, created by a company appropriately named Peak Enterprises, foreshadowing the climb to come. The challenge, it started over 20 years ago with a culture focused on teamwork and perseverance. We hope our story is inspiring to all entrepreneurs with ideas none too small. We're an American company with a story worth telling. video gets me excited every time I watch it. I think they did an unbelievable job. 
uh, creating the video, but then also incorporating that into their package. So I want you guys to wrap your head around this. Imagine your package on the shelf with an embedded QR code that a customer can scan and watch a video like that. So the next one we're going to watch is all about educational, oh, I'm sorry, uh, educational products, training, and safety videos. So this would be cool if you had workers that you didn't want to have to actually teach. You wanted them to scan the bottle that they had to use in the manufacturing facility and watch a video on how to actually use the product. Affordable dilution control has never been easier with Fast Draw Freedom. Fast Draw Freedom is a simple and versatile chemical management system that saves you time and money. The Fast Draw Freedom is easy to use. First, connect the Freedom to a Fast Draw bottle, then connect to a hose, turn the water on, rotate to the bottle or bucket fill position, rotate to the off position when done. As an added benefit, the Fast Draw Freedom has the capability to be a foamer. First, remove the fill tube end, then turn the dial to the bucket fill position. Only the Fast Draw Freedom allows you to clean without limits. So how much easier is learning when you watch a video versus actually having to read very teeny tiny fine print. I know for me, if my wife gives me a project at home, the first thing I do if I don't know how to do it is I go out to YouTube and I watch a video to see how to do it properly. So our next video is going to be product use, promotion, and contest. Uh, Bud Light actually did a mosaic print here uh, that just got people extremely excited. Now, I can't do this video any justice. I think you guys just have to watch it. It's pretty compelling. Now, this is all mosaic print. As more and more brands try to engage music fans, they often just create more noise. Logos on a music stage have become just wallpaper and meaningless without the right brand behaviors. We know the best way to engage an audience is through authenticity and creating value for fans. Which is why we created 31 music-inspired Bud Light cans for the 7th Annual Mad Decent Block Party. Including four special hero cans, which were co-branded with the Mad Decent and Bud Light logos together. Using an innovative printing technology, we created 31 million unique label variations, so no two cans would be exactly alike. We pioneered Bud Light to not only be the first beer brand, but the first brand in the United States to use this new packaging technology. Bud Light presented at 22 Mad Decent block parties in 18 different cities with over 63 different artists performing. On Facebook, we've reached 23.1 million unique people with over 54.3 million impressions. Twitter generated 4.1 million impressions with an engagement rate of over 15%, and influencers on Instagram generated 13 million impressions. The Festival Cans generated 81.6 million impressions, leading to a 97% positive sentiment. People were so excited by the new Bud Light look, they asked where they could buy more to take home. In the end, Bud Light became more than just a presenting sponsor. It literally became collectible in fans' hands, reshaping perceptions, building music authenticity, and embraced by the Mad Decent Block Party artists on stage. What do you guys think of that? I think that's pretty exciting. Um, you don't really have to spend hundreds of thousands of dollars advertising anymore. When you do cool things like Mosaic, you let people do the advertising for you and it's free. Um, 
So you heard the statistics. So next is our security video. Now this is going to talk to you guys about embedded security in the label or ink. What would you do if each and every product you produced had its very own fingerprint? What would you protect if you could track and trace every printed piece you put out into the world at any given point in its life cycle? What would you create if your customers could interact with that unique ID to learn about your product, to verify its authenticity, to engage with your brand in real time? What would you do with ingenuity like that? Introducing Link Technology from HP. It's a printing innovation that uses the high-speed creation and embedding of marks and unique IDs to give every single product you produce its own individual identity. A digital fingerprint that can be made visible or invisible, that can go on your label, on your package, or directly on your product, and can be followed from here to here to here. With HP Lab's portfolio of secure marks and seamless digital press integration, you can easily match and identify packaging and final products in your supply chain to know exactly where each item is, while it's made, when it's shipped, where it's distributed, and that it's where it's supposed to be, enabling you to prevent diversion, avoid theft, and combat gray markets. Link Technologies Secure Marks allow you to quickly verify and authenticate products at any point in their life cycle, helping you guard against counterfeits, save on costly recalls, and defend your brand from start to finish. Link Technology also gives you the power to create real-time interactive experiences that move your customer closer to your brand, empowering you to develop one-to-one -one relationships and deliver targeted offers and personalized content in real time, all with one mark. From packaged goods to publishing, from graphics and photos to direct mail and marketing collateral, from your brand and your products to all the people they touch everywhere, every day. Link technology from HP. Find out what you can do with it at linkcreationstudio.com. just kind of bring this to a close before John uh, starts his portion of the webinar, but I just want to let you guys know all of this can be achieved with our digital print capabilities. Um, Century Label has four HP Indigos. Um, we, can, we can help you guys um, if you have any questions on QR codes or security features. Uh, consecutive numbering for traceability, mosaic, uh, variable data and personalization, or names, numbers, pictures, etc. pulling from Excel databases. So thank you guys so much for listening in. I'm going to pass this off to John now. Excellent, Joe. What, a, what a very incredible presentation.